So I do have a story to tell before we get started with yet another Zombie Survivors, and it's uh, part of why I'm telling this is to explain why I have access to it. You might remember... Oh, hello Deadshot also. You might remember I used to do a Let's Look At series. Well, a decade ago, and I do literally mean a decade ago, 2014, I covered a game which was a little basic called yet another zombie defense game. And 10 years later, the dev got in touch to say thank you very much for covering the game back then. Would you like to have early access to my new game? Which is yeah, another zombie survivors. It is a vampire survivors like is is a private beta build. It is not done as it says here. So I said, sure, and it looks like you've come a long way. I can only hope that this is actual music made for the game and not something that's licensed because otherwise YouTube VODs will have problems. But we're going to play this for an hour and I'm probably going to make it into an actual hour of even though the VOD of this stream will hopefully be up unchanged. And yeah, we're just going to try it and see how it plays. I, I worry that it's a bit loud even though I've turned it down quite a bit. Let me just lower the master volume just to just lower everything just a little bit more. And I haven't played any of it off camera so we're jumping into it blind. We'll just see what there is. Is that Lara Croft? Looks a lot like her. Same bow as well. Alright, so we have SWAT tank and engineer, but there's also Huntress, Ghost, Medic, Pyro, and two other classes to unlock. Currently. Weapon, it looks like a Desert Eagle and an Uzi. Helicopter, grenades. What is that? That's a sh two different kinds of shotgun, I think. Like a Winchester and a Spas 12. A buzzsaw and a mine for abilities. A little sumptuous meat. A little pram as well. And this is... what is that? Some kind of shotgun and... glue gun? <laughs> I don't know. While their classmates were making potato powered batteries, they built a pla- oh, plasma! Okay. Well, let's just go with the basics, because he's probably like the basic guy, so... And there's three biomes currently, but five planned, I guess? Oh, yep. I, I played many a uh, zombie survivor, uh, vampire survivors like. Standard yet another zombie survivors game mode that lasts up to 20 minutes. Can you survive the night until dawn? And then there's endless hardcore extermination one hit mode. Oof. Hello Frost, it's been a bit. Welcome back. Although I see you've been keeping up your sub though because you're at 96 months. Good grief. Badge collection. Oh, is this to modify difficulty, I guess? It must be, because there's... Okay, well, well, first run, so we ain't going to see any of that. I presume I'm not going to need the mouse for this, it's just going to be WASD. Although, no, I might need to steer the aim a little bit. Okay, do I have a map? I appear not to have. What do you drop? XP. That makes sense, it's a vampire survivor's like. That's health, obviously. And that's zero out of 500 money. Oh, stole that zombie's wallet. Can I zoom in? Doesn't seem like it. So it is just WSD, really. Me plays zombies. No, I'm hunting zombies. Not playing as zombies. Select power up. A pistol, so it increases the damage of the pistol. Grenade trail, forget about your worries as you throw them behind you like hand grenades. Or use a helicopter transmitter to call in an attack helicopter from the nearby base. It's got a long cooldown now. Uh, let's try grenades. What is this? So you can banish twice and reroll four times. Do I need to press a button to do this? Oh no, there it goes. That wasn't behind me, but I'll, I'll accept it. Oh no, it hit me. That was a quick level. Kill a zombie by leveling up. A killer feature. The game already has achievements. Hello, Valor. I hope your nerdy, crappy D&D went well. Let's raise our base damage here. Boom. Desert Eagle fires or reloads kind of slow. I kind of want that health. Oh, they just got started. Let's call on a helicopter strike, see what happens. Oh, I think that was it right there. 
Is that armor? Oh, no, there it is. 45 second cooldown, no. Stone skin. Uh, let's upgrade the grenades. I presume we don't have the full arsenal available on run one, so our options are going to be kind of limited. It seems to be these three each time, in fact. Um, upgrade the grenades again. Yeah, this is yet another zombie survivors. Despite the fact that it's the first zombie survivors that I'm aware of. That's just the naming convention they use. Wow, one hit does a hundred damage, that's rough. Ooh, what's that? A big XP, I guess. Oh, it probably does the vampire survivors thing where if enough XP drops it gathers. Can I stand in this and not get hurt? Yeah, okay. I wonder if I'm supposed to be, like, finding a shop or something. Because I don't see the purpose of the money yet. Uh, let's upgrade the pistol again. Oh, need that. That's faster zombies now, too. Oh, there we go. Spray and pray. Oh, does it replace the pistol? Oh, it does. Whoops. Oh, it seems better, actually. Oh. I wanted that arm. I'm gonna have to run through them. Yeah. <laughs> I parried because of the stone skin. Oh, there we go. That's probably where the money is used. Is this costing money? I think I just get to pick one. A glass of milk. Increases your max HP with kills. Ooh. Every time you receive damage, get weapon speed. Magnets spawn twice as often. Gives a chance for the ability activation to reduce... Oh, that's the airplane. I mean the helicopter. I think I'll just take a... <laughs> this is what I'd order if I go to a pub. I'll have a glass of milk, please. Ooh, big red diamond. Let's upgrade. Well, now we're using this. I've got to upgrade it. Yeah, so the XP gathers together. That was worth more. I don't know what it means when injure appears. Like, I think it slows them down, maybe. Uh, yeah, sure. Upgrade the grenades. I want that health. Max pain! Just 5% more damage on everything. Absolutely. Infinite. Hello, Seeker. Hello, Mixter. Hello, Kitty. Hello, anyone else I missed? Must have some level of backache from all the 360 no scoping. He's built different. I mean, look at him. He's clearly played COD. Hello, Daniel. Daniel's in the YouTube chat. For those in the Twitch chat, he says hello. Oh, that's a tankier one there, I think. SOS signal detected. Oh, the dude. Oh, okay, so you actually have multiple people. A tank for max health. Oh wait, they all give max health. Oh, but I bet you get access to their gear, right? Let the rescue person take shelter in the military base and receive a level up in $800 instead. No, I want them. I'll take the tank. Yeah, there we go. He's got a shotgun. My zombie killing weapon of choice when I go zombie hunting in real life. Don't ask. Oh, poisoned one? I, I want this item here, ideally. 
Yeah, so it gives you access. Tank's favourite after hours activity was to arm toy drones with circular saws. Gotta see it. White power up duration lifetime doubles the amount of ammunition for all weapons. Oh, that's really good. But more damage against bosses at the cost of basic damage. I want more ammo. Oh, it's like the it's like the Bible in Vampire Survivors. I see. There's more XP back there, so I kind of want to go there, but. Our health's getting a little low. I think when I maxed out my cash is when that... Sub oh! I wasn't expecting the explosion to do that much. Get eaten by the undead. Excuse me, streamer, I exploded. By a boomer. Killer feature, free items, rock... Oh, so it's unlocked more stuff. I will just... We'll try again as him. Before we try someone else. Alright, watch out for the exploding dude to do it. That must have been at least 300 damage. Boomers win again. Things you never hear in real life for 400, please, Alex. We will immediately start with a pistol upgrade. So I presume it's if they touch that circle around you, classes is getting hit. Because I'm pretty sure a lot of those times there I wasn't actually getting touched by them, but the circle probably was. And that's to account for the fact you can have multiple bodies, I suppose. That's gotta be it. Boomers think they win again. Now that's more like it. Uh, yep. The helicopter is so long recast, it doesn't feel super worth it. So I'm not going to get it this time. I'm going to focus on the grenade and the gun. And the Uzi once we can switch to that. I think it's when you upgrade the pistol to a certain number, maybe? I do want that money still. Excuse me, just gonna slip on by you here. Let's upgrade the grenades again. Oh. Nice. You're eating extra crunchy peanut butter. Marshmallow fluff sour cherry, cherry jelly sandwich. Good grief. What do we do to peanut butter to make it extra crunchy? Uh, pistol. It's a kind of crappy upgrade, but the next one's the change of weapon, I think. Nope, not quite. What will we take this time? I mean, I still like this. Receive a cat. If you receive cash from any source, it gives you super speed. I still just like having max HP on kills. Well, we have plus one health from the kills I've done so far. It does say enhancement. So yeah, it is changing your gun. The base stats look like what I got the pistol to, so it does seem like a direct increase. It did 208 damage from the explosion, apparently. That is a lot. Considering you have 700 health to start with. Okay, now the faster... Oh, SOS. Pardon me, gentlemen. If the dev ever ends up seeing this, if you ever want to add, like, a blue-haired character with a scythe, I wouldn't complain. I still want to see more of the tank. I'm going to get hit here for sure as well. Yeah, your circle gets bigger. Upgrade shotgun. Good old shotgun. Nothing beats shotgun. This is far as zombie killing goes. I 
that XP, but I'm having trouble getting in there. Oh, I think I got hit there. Fuse and scatter landmines in the immediate area to give the undead a fun surprise. Let's try that. Step on the glowing dot on the floor for a fun surprise. You heard the game. Extra peanut chunks. Okay. Um, I, I trust too much in shotguns, clearly. What is this? Speed? Yep. Oh, we're over a thousand health now. Having a bit of a hard time double doubling back for XP pickups though. There's a chest over here somewhere. Oh. Yeah. Let's add a saw blade into the conundrum. There we go. Quick. White power up duration and lifetime. I don't know which ones that applies to. Is that kinetic? the amount of ammunition for all weapons that have more than one bullet. I mean, it's just, that seems so good. The Horde Evolves, Danger Level 2. New progress! Wait, where's the exploding poison ones then? Oh, there they are. be most useful here. More base damage, I guess, for my starting guy. Yeah, they leave quite a large exploding area. I'm noticing that I don't think any health has dropped this time. Oh, got hit again. Oh, there's a health. It must have heard me. I think I just got exploded again, so I've lost more health than I'm about to gain. Yeah. It is, it's already this difficult. We've only survived five minutes of 20. Just a little scratch that's never hurt anyone in the zombie apocalypse ever. Attack speed, magazine size, sure. Oh, that was a new shotgun. Who is this? Oh, I can get the other dude. Yeah, gimme. Team of three. Lead a full squad of survivors. Okay. Ah, uh, that's a large lad. That's an exceptionally large lad. Receive cash from any source, give super speed. Let's do the. We kind of need that. It looks like I've got a donut spinning around me. Get him. Get him. Get him while he's stopped. Get him. Taser him. In the nuts. Like that one guy who died. Of the way there, do there. Oh, I'm much closer to death, unfortunately. That's too many guys. Electric turret, go! <laughs> Whatever it is, do it! I 
I need those health really, really badly. Oh, he died! Can't get the XP drop, though. Just a little XP as a treat. Let's go for... SMG. Well, I can tell. Well, I've got the boss XP. It was not worth it because I got hit twice. Three times, in fact. Let's upgrade his shotgun. That seems pretty good. We're holding them at bay, kind of. I really want the six feet and the shield. Yeah, I'm gonna get hit there now. Looking, oh, I think there's another large lad as well. Oh, there is. It's whatever that is. Blech. I think I got killed by a swarm of locusts. I did. A fly. Zombie apocalypse, and he died to fly. Me and the boys. Electric personality. Well, now I know he's all electric weapons. I want to try him. So let's go back to the menu and see what kind of unlocks we get. Oh yeah, there's like there's a permanent upgrade system, that will help. Max health points. Maximum speed in which player controlled character can move. Fire rate. I'm just gonna take like a level and everything. Damage, absolutely. This is all this is general, this is not class specific. Damage of offensive abilities, amount of XP, distance cash you earn. How many points do I have left to spend? I'm gonna try the engineer, so just give him some. Oh, that's it. All right, points spent. Apparently, I still have 18. Oh, maybe it's there's specific points to each class too. Yeah, six, eleven. I've got one left here, which is not enough for anything. That. Yeah. Oh, eventually he gets assault rifles and stuff. Unlocks two final evolutions available in the form of the fifth rank upgrades. Oh, there's synergies. Interesting. Can't get it right now, but that's alright. Looks neat. Actually, give him a scythe, and that's close enough. One of uh, that's not enough to get anything. All right, I want to try the engine. How do I unlock these? Survive 15 minutes, kill 99 more zombie bosses. So let's kill 100 in total then. Collect 90 health packs. Deal 1.9 million more elemental damage. Well, I'm going to be doing electrical. Be a witness. Oh, you have to survive the first area to get the second. Okay. Oh, now I can put that on, so I get more cash and whatever specialization is. Sure. Well, Jack, this has been on your Steam wishlist for a while. Well, this isn't a review, this is just me trying it out for an hour, but I reviewed the devs' first game a literal decade ago, so they got in touch to say thank you and give me access to this. my guy. Electrical weapons. I found my main. 
So, overcharge your 1000 volt battery, so that's like an AOE thing, let's try that. Okay, I thought it'd be like a, a permanent little dome for a little while or something, but that's fine. Let's set down an electrical turret. Would you like some electrical attacks with your electrical attacks? Bit of a small AoE though, I will say that. I'm kind of having to lure them into it. Let's upgrade our basic gun. Oh, it doesn't linger that long either. Let's upgrade the basic gun again. This taser's gonna disappear before they... Oh no, there we go. Big AOE got him. It ran out! Yeah. <laughs> Worst time impossible. More taser, I want the gun that's beyond this. There we go. Oh, does chain lightning as well? That is my bag, baby. something over here. So that would be faster turret spawning. Yes, let's try that. This seems more of his thing. How do you like electricity? So we put electricity in your electricity? That's what I'm talking about! Magazine size? Sure. I was kind of hoping it would spread to more targets or something. Yeah, fenced in here. Hello, BB. This new res. Oh, you got me hit! I was reading your chat. This new Resident Evil looks great. That damage was because of you. Now I'm gonna become a zombie. I hope you're happy. Oh, there's a health there. You're forgiven if I get it without getting hit. Okay, you're forgiven. Hmm, I'm not gonna get out without getting hit. Yeah. You're no longer forgiven again! XP pickups. That is a lot of XP. There's a level in two thirds. Oh, the item just spawned right there. That's not good. I got caught. We'll do a quick run back. Actually, no, if I have skill points, I want to spend them. I have 11? Oh, that's in toll. It's got to be in toll. Yeah. What would this do? Duration damage. Ah, it doesn't increase range. make them a little bit better.
Out of the vote fair, this one with 45% or something, Space Marine had 25, I think. And Lethal Company got zero votes. Hello, Serenity. Did you remember to vote this time after reading all the options, Sumptuous Meat? I mentioned you specifically. Although you wouldn't have seen that if you're a sub, not a patron, because I mentioned it on Patreon. I used you as an example of what happens when you don't read all the options. You wouldn't want to be like Sumptuous Meat now, would you? That was like two months ago, and yet I still remember. Let's go for the turret. The I wish it's... well actually yeah, it does have ranges of stats so it must eventually increase. So getting that better gun is my priority I think with the chain lightning effect it seemed the most effective. Has anyone ever done a co-op Vampire Survivors like yet? You went for a new thing, but there was more than one new thing on the poll. There was two new things. You went for this new thing, fair enough. Electric personality. Magnet power-ups also now collect military training points, health packs, and white power-ups. Hmm. I'm gonna take the armor because I think I'm gonna get hit more often as this guy because you have to stand still more. Or rather you have to stay around your turret more. Hit me for 86 damage. Hello, Cart. Cart, did you vote for Fortnite in the poll? Just, I'm just curious who the one vote for Fortnite was. I'm gonna get hit after I grab this guy. Tank! Mm, Sodron. Oh, so it wasn't you. Okay. Well, now I'm curious who the hell was. Hmm, do I throw another thing in the mix? Sure. That's nice. Although if they are especially run young, I will say babies smile at basically anything, including when they defecate.
crowd surfing. I'm gonna run out of room eventually. <laughs> ah, there you go. Oh, okay. I need to only read chat when I'm buying upgrades. Seems like such a like not good enough upgrade for the taser, but I'm hoping that the next upgrade level four will be more significant. Oh no! I need to get back to that item, but they're not giving me any through path because my hitbox is too large. It's ridiculous. Stores 100% HP. Give me that. <laughs> Wait, how did I use it? I should have read that. I thought it. I thought it would immediately apply. Maybe it's when you take lethal damage. Nope. Damn it. What did it say? 100% of HP when you take this item. Every fifth health pack. Restores 100% HP when you take this item. That's a glitch. It did not do that. I still only had one hit left. So that is unfortunate. Alright, so far I'm finding it harder to use this guy, but maybe it's because he needs upgrades. Maybe that's his thing. Let's go spend those points. Like, have I unlocked this? Like, will these new weapons appear now? Oh, area. Yeah, that that's more important. And give me more... Damage on offensive abilities and more health. That might be the cinch. What did I still have two points on? Well, something I can't spend. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a badge you have to wear, though. Well, that's fine. We have space. So, the turret will have 10% larger a radius and stay for 10% longer. I think the trouble with doing co-op in Vampire Survivors likes is because it's so difficult to juggle how many enemies there are with frame rate, and then if you have to mix in net code as well, it gets kind of rough. Would be neat though. Because every Vampire Survivors like I've played has been solo, as far as I'm aware. Alright, let's see this larger area. I mean, it, it's ever it's ten percent larger. Yep, it is. I think. That was a quick level. League of Legends did a co-op Vampire Survivors? That would explain why I've never heard of it. I kind of like getting this down as fast. 14 seconds? That's pretty good. Because it is doing a lot of damage early on. 12 second recast? That's some good damage.
Ability critical damage plus five. No, not yet. Yeah, that's what it is. It's like every 12 seconds I clear every basic zombie around me. Ho oh ho! Should probably start upgrading the old bog standard taser so I can get access to the better guns I need. But Take something that makes my abilities happen more often. White power up also gives you a random white power up of another type. Yeah. I'm just gonna take the extra armor. I could have re-rolled actually, I keep forgetting you do have built-in re-rolls. I should have, I should have re-rolled. Oh well. Good XP, come on, here we burst, now's the time. There. Switch to the chain lightning Tesla. Just in time for the AOE again, hopefully, quickly. Any second now. Any second now, there we go. Right. And hello Lil Jack, I'm glad you got caught up because we will be playing that after this. I think the turret a little bit better. I'm trusting in the abilities more than the gun currently. Like that definitely is larger now, you can tell that. Oh, damn it. Oh, there's health. So it's... And the enemies have got a tank here, that's a problem. Thankfully, that's still one shot. Um, all abilities plus five damage. Let's do it. I clearly haven't been picking up a lot of cash because I think that's what makes the survivors appear. Ah, it's gonna hit me. Yeah. I feel like I'm more in keeping with the curve the enemies are on now. Killing Frenzy. Whipping cooldown. Whipping cooldown? It's not really what I'm after. When you get hit, create an explosion. That might be useful. Annoying trumpet. I'm dooting! I might see what happens if you just send this guy away, although it's a nice chance for them to get XP and skill points without me having to play as them, even if I don't. Uh, oh, <laughs> it actually... It makes the noise. I need the AOE to kick in or I can't get that guy. That's a problem. There we are. Uh -huh. That's the noise from Barrel Drama. We're still gonna get some electrical upgrades because I think he still gets XP regardless. So. Oh, was I touching the poison there? I guess so. Oh, that's a different boss. Hello. That's the third different type of boss we've seen. Charging guy, fly lady, and him. Oh, we're not killing him fast enough.
keep falling behind the damage curve. Oh, at least I do it as I died. I died the way I lived. It looks like he maybe gets, yeah, he gets a small amount. But he wasn't there for that long, so it makes sense. General, just give me more damage and reload, sure. What is this? With Huntress? Nope, don't have her yet. Plus 25 damage, plus magazine size. Kinda wish I'd done that one actually. Oh well. Alright, we've got time for one more run. I'm gonna try and make him work. Can someone check the Steam page? Like, is there a demo available or a date this is releasing? I don't quite remember what was mentioned to me in the email. Getting the burst is the best bet for first upgrade just because it's a clearer until later on. Early access right now, okay. So that means this build is probably available then. Sometime in 2025 is when 1.0 is scheduled. Okay. Sounds good. It does have a demo to play, Jack says. So if you want to try it for yourself, feel free. That was a very quick level. How dare you touch me? Nothing gives you that right. New weapon. Go. Second now is the burst. Yeah. I'm trying to see if it does damage with the Oh, so I'm gonna get hit when I get this. Annoying trumpet! Trumpet, ha! Fine, we'll get the, the electrical turret just so we have something else doing damage. It's certainly a way to get XP at the cost of health, but uh, how little health is dropping, that's probably not the best bet. It is just an annoying trumpet. It is what it is. Oh no, I'm stuck in this situation again. 
Oh, there we go. Slipped out that time. Do I want the XP? No, I'm gonna get hit here. Yeah. <laughs> There's health! Oh, we spawn back there. I kind of feel like the hitbox is a little overly generous for the enemies. I mean, there's multiple bodies, I get that, but for a single body? At least it shows you, I guess. This is going to give me 300 health. Is it max? Oh no, it does restore 300. Okay. Reloading there. Uh, I'm gonna reroll. I want to try for the med. Like, yeah, restores 100% HP when you take this item. It lies. It doesn't do that at all! But if I pick up a health pack, it does do more. But one of those would have to drop before I get murdered. Well, I tried to pick one up, but there was in poison. <laughs> but net positive was slightly in my favor there. I don't know, it must have been 100% more. Anything so much as sneezes on me, I'm dead. Oh, just as I got a laser? Oh, that's cool. That's pretty cool. No! Oh, here it comes. Oh, wait, here we. No, we're, we're screwed, we're stuck. Eventually, I'm gonna hit the corner. Oh, or, you know, the circle can briefly be touched by a zombie. That too. The laser seems cool, though. Now that is what the game is called, yep. You do get upgrade points super quick. Faster level ups. That sounds useful. What does he get? A minigun and a rocket launcher. Oh, and more health and armor. That necessarily is a good badge in general to have. That would be more damage. This would be even more area. That's useful to me. So he gets, after the laser, he gets a blaster. Launches, oh, it's the doom gun. You're downloading the demo right now. I hope you enjoy it. Shame we don't really get to see what weapons the other unlockable classes have yet. But yeah, I also wasn't doing that great, so... But there is permanent unlocks to make it better. Or easier, rather. Oh yeah, and there's, there's Deep Rock Survivor-esque final evolutions on certain levels. Which take the form of the 5th rank upgrades. Okay. And this must... Oh yeah, so if we get one more level with the Engineer, we open up this tier of unlocks for them. But it's not complete, obviously, because look at all these empty spaces. So it seems like they've left themselves room to get a bunch of other stuff. Okay. There's a lot of achievements. Wikipedia enemies. I've only seen. Wait, who's this? Oh, I've seen more than just that boss, but I guess it only fills it in if you get the kill, because that's the one boss I killed. Boomer, runner, basic zombie, charger. Yeah, because we didn't kill those other bosses, it hasn't filled it in.
Okay, so every class has four weapons. But you have to upgrade the previous one to get access to it. And four abilities in total as well. And their final mutation levels make them operate differently. We've seen every power-up. What does this do? You get invincibility for five seconds. Ah. There is a lot of items to unlock. Military training. Oh, these are generic upgrades. Because we've had some of these appear, yeah. And they have different... values depending on how rare they are. I see... Time played 33 minutes? Mmm, that's not correct. We've been playing for 58 minutes 5 seconds, to be exact. But I guess it means, like, time actually within runs. Alright, so we found one little bug, or it might be incorrect text on the med pack upgrade. It does not heal you 100% when you pick it up. But that's okay. Let me just quickly look at the Steam page, since we're at the end of the hour I was going to give the game. Although I might just muck around. I, I usually play Survivor-like games in my own time, like I put in a lot of time to Brotato. That's my kind of go-to Vampire Survivors-like. But I usually just do that off-camera when I have, like, 40 minutes to kill. Yep, it's currently sitting on very positive. Uh, the early access version that I presume is this was released in July this uh, last year, actually. Although it's been updated, obviously, as it goes along. There is a demo you can try for free, or it is £8.50 to buy, which I presume would mean it's $10, if I had to guess. And you can also get it in a bundle with other zombie-related games or some other games that uh, they've done. Yeah, it was neat. It's certainly a survivor game. I like them as time killers. And the game by them I tried 10 years ago was yet another zombie defense game. Actually, I can't believe how many people played that. Like, it was such a, it was just a, like a small little thing back then. And it's got like 12 and a half thousand reviews. It's on very positive. I remember it being just like a, a super basic thing. Oh, it looks like they added four player online co-op. I don't know if it originally had that or not. So I'm sure that helped. It is $10. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so. That was nice of the dev to get in touch to say, hey, remember a decade ago when you played my game? Here, try this. And it's an obvious step up in visual quality and it's fun and it works. Even though it's early access, we found one little thing that was wrong and that's it. So if you're interested, go check it out.